Wow, that guy just walked in and walked through that building just before I came out. Who the hell is he? Oh, wait. He don't look like he work here. But it made things easier. Hi, right, I'm sorry. You don't. Yeah, is he is is he new or is he at a perp? He just walked through when I walked. And yeah, I guess he's new here because I never saw him before. If they'll freaking hire him, they ought to hire me to work here. Here go the tra perp traffic, everybody. Well, I'm trying to take out the trash. And for, I, my weird ass is taking out the trash in the rain. And look at that perp in the white truck right there. Like you waiting for me. See? It's, it, I mean, it's raining. And you still come to perp me. Oh, look at somebody getting out the truck. What? Oh, this weird. Damn. Wait. So I said everybody gotta do something weird. And I hate how people try to dictate or try to control how you should handle your targeting situation. And then we'll get mad when you don't take their so-called advice. Y'all, you don't live here. Why, why are you coming? The, now, that, that's a perp right there. You don't live here. And you come and, uh, you see, y'all on the other property. And it look like the business is closed. And look what you're doing. What are y'all doing? You don't stay here. Weird as hell. I didn't know it was raining until I came after I came outside, but I'm like, what the hell anyway? It's a dog on street theater. And another perp neighbor just came out. Yeah. That's as far as these perps will go. I don't even know if you do stay here. But if you did stay here, right? And, and it's like the eternal, um, what are you doing? Weirdo. Let me make a joke. Oh, look, the cat's perping me too. <laughs> I'm just playing. That's the cat that wants some love the other day. Y'all didn't realize it was raining until I came out here, but. Oh, well. But while you had to do this and then come through the building right when I'm come take out the trash. This is a gang stalker right here. Nobody's perping me. Ain't nobody gang stalking me. You act the, you, the way you move and it's kind of, you know, suspicious. It's weird. And then you drop that other guy in there. The new guy, you know, he... So, what kind of weird shit y'all on? Well, look. <laughs> Three of them. 
I'm just joking about the cats, you know. But I I did hear some targeted individuals say that cats gang stalking too. And why, if you stand out here smoking in the rain after making all that noise, see, yeah, some strange activity now. You can't say I'm not being gang stalked or, you know, I'm glad I haven't seen that crazy demon Alex in a while, you know, and here's another weirdo, you gotta take out your trash too, look like an illegal. Can't even take out the trash in peace all by myself. Herbs trying to mimic and mock what I do. I'm not being gang stalked, but y'all don't see a pattern that every time. I go take out the trash. Somebody has to watch or monitor me while I'm taking out the trash. Or they they, they got to do being like monkey see, monkey do. You know, mimicking you. I guess to let you know you're being watched. So they got a new staff member here. Got to watch out for him too. Because I ain't never seen him. but Never saw him before. New perp staff member. Make sure you're wearing your red. And then he walk around here with the mannerisms and attitude like as if he's the owner or some shit like that. And your ass is brand new. I never saw you here before. Shucks, I tried to get a job to work here. And, you know, I was told you can't work here and stay here. I'm like, well, what if I check out? Then would you give me a job? And they say, nope. So... But you know, everything being, I don't know if he's new here too. And I never saw him before. He, I don't know if he's new here or if he, all right, he's new. Got your phone. Another set of illegals. Wow. So I ended up taking a um, three-hour nap. I couldn't try to resist and try to wait till later. I could not fight it. So, you know, I get, it, it must have been much-needed sleep that I got with the, you know, falling asleep at about 2.30. Sorry, taking the glove off my hand. Falling asleep at 2.30 and then wake up. At um, see how the TV is lower now, and then later on tonight is gonna be louder. Doing that on purpose. So. Yes, and, and then the fake T.I. perps and regular perps will be like, and narcissistic abusers will be like, well, that don't mean you're being gang stalked, or they'll say, that don't mean you're being gang stalked, or they'll say, um, you know, they'll reverse it on you and lie and say that 
you're the one who's, you know, bullying and bothering random innocent people minding their own business. When you know damn well I'm being gang stalked. And, you know, you want to deter the, you know, the the new people, confuse gaslight and deter the new people who are going through this. Plus, um, the outsiders, you know, you want to make outsiders believe, you know, y'all are part of a, um, like the fake T.I. perps is like a counter T.I. program. You know, it's just like the same people who claim to be counter terrorism is actually, you know, secretly behind. They front like they're fighting against terrorism while they're secretly defending terrorism. But like the PETA people, you know, they push that veganism stuff, but secretly behind your back, you know, they're torturous and cruel to animals. You know, and I've heard about, you know, animal cruelty with PETA while they pretend to front like they love animals more than humans. I mean, but you torture and sacrifice human, I mean, animals, probably humans too, but animals. And, and you know, you hypocritically go around telling people don't eat meat and you act like you do these video, these uh, movies like Food, Inc. and Forks Over Knives. And, you know, try to deter, pe deter people from wanting to eat meat and trying to, you know, use that vegetarian and vegan propaganda to try to scare people away from wanting to eat meat while you torture animals your damn self, while you pretend to front like you're exposing something like that, you know. So, that's it for this doggone video. And, hey, y'all gonna see for yourself, if you see a pattern Every time I got to take out the trash, other people got to take out the trash. Even if I'm not taking out the trash, if I'm going out some, somewhere to do something, another perp or two of somebody will come and, you know, they got to they gotta be just taking out the trash. Every time I come out, you taking out the trash. You know, you want to come and do something suspicious or just funny and weird, you know. But I guess the people in the white truck, they want it to be seen, you know, because why the hell you drop somebody off that don't stay here? You drop them off and they even the perps who don't live here, they even allowed to come and walk in this building and stuff like that, like walk through all through this building. And I've seen that with the perps, um, you know, at that hotel that I stayed in in July for that week and they had the perps on camera, you know, the black ghetto female who acted like she wanted to fight me and she called me crazy to my face, like last July and um, threatened to have me locked up in a mental institution when she knew damn well she was perping me and, um, you know, she had the freaking one t funny tail lights or one tail light or something like that with your red, your red vehicle and you want to be ghetto trash, you know so I'm going to see y'all in a while. Love y'all and bye.